the place was not uh, like I thought it would be. Uh, it was far more modernized and uh, clean and uh, planned and ordered. And I expected something a little more, uh, a little more patinaed and a little more of the old. You know, when I say the old, I don't mean a thousand years ago. I mean 1920s, 19, you know what I mean? Like turn of the century. ものすごくやっぱり中に入ってると思った、うん、自分がやっぱり大事な本当に大事な役をやらせてもらってるというのはもちろんあったねやり方の違いをもし聞いてるんだとしたらね、まあ、例えば大阪でもあんなふうに堂々と全部を交通を遮断してねものすごいライティングをして撮るっていうことは日本映画の場合はありえない。After, uh, after Wall Street. I was looking to play a more physical action oriented part. And、uh, my agents、uh, sent me this script and、uh, the character I liked. And I also liked the fact that it,、uh, it dealt with uh, uh, another subject matter、uh, and an opportunity for us to explore our two cultures, both our differences, what we agree about and what we don't agree about. At the same time,、uh, hopefully, make a, a two hour entertaining movie. And those were the qualities that attracted me to it、um, initially.、Um, Jaffe and Lansing, I'd worked with on, on、uh, Fatal Attraction, and are much more than just commissioned producers. Stanley Jaffe has won an Oscar for Kramer vs. Kramer. And, And they're both excellent producers and allowed me more freedom to focus on,、uh, on, the, on the acting. I wanted the Japanese to be not the way we expect them to be. We expect them to be small and, you know, to a degree subservient, right? I wanted them to be tough, big, totally contemporary. And、uh, I wanted the Sato character to be a very,、uh, you know, obviously, be a very dangerous. Character, but at the same time to be intelligent, to have a real point of view, and be, basically be trying to change the system. What am I supposed to do? It was very obvious that, that this was a, a young leading man who had, who had a certain sexuality and,、uh, and a certain.、Um, Uh, uh, charisma. I was quite overwhelmed because I felt that he had so much to offer as an artist. He had a tremendous inner, inner strength.、Um, he had a strong core. He, he acted as if he had a secret. Mysterious character. And that was what was wonderful because you couldn't. Ever tell what he was thinking. You know, he just had a way of being there and in, in being inscrutable, as it were. And,、uh, and that was very important. Cheers. I am. Yeah. Cherry was a rookie. I th remember thinking that, you know, Matsuda san was more than we ever imagined. And you could see just his, his extraordinarily breadth of acting, the, 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 the dynamic range. Take it from him, huh? Right. <laughs> There was that wonderful feeling. Of being in the presence of an excellent actor,、uh, an actor who always surprised you.、Uh, you never knew what he was going to do next, which I think was one of、uh, Matsuda san's wonderful qualities, is you never knew what was going to happen. I've been fortunate to work with some very dynamic actors, and I found him to be as good as or, or better than most actors I've ever worked with. After the film came out, I got a lot of calls about him, not just for parts that、um, required a Japanese actor, but for parts that required 